This is called Vermont Talking Blues by Mark Pendergrass, which is me. And I wrote it many years ago. Uh, I came to Vermont uh, in the 70s. Well, I went up to old Vermont with my suitcase and my trunk. Had my money in my hand, thought I'd buy a piece of land. Old farmhouse, barn, sugar maples, and a big old wood stove. I found a real estatey man, said if anyone can help, I think I can. Got just a place for you, off route a hundred a mile or two. Need some fixing up, he says, but you look handy. <clears throat> Looking at my wallet. You bet, I says. <coughs> well, I went and had a look around. The barn was sort of falling down. The sills under the house were gone. Past our walls, a wire and a runny john. But I could tell right away it was home. Pastures plenty. Good old maples, and besides, I could afford it. I drove my Dodge up the dirt road, you all just about to explode. Moved right in September 16, never saw a place so green. October 1st, it snowed, froze, pipes busted, up all night fixing them. Eyes handy though. <coughs> Gotta turn the page. Well, the wood stove used a lot of wood. Hadn't cut as much as I should, so I chainsawed down an old elm tree, already dead from that dread disease. And I started in to split it up. Sunk three wedges in the log, dulled my axe, splintered the handle of my sledge, decided to buy a cord or two down the road. Jumped in the dodge to start her up. She went err, err, and then hiccup. She went err, err, some more, and then she kind of hummed high and thin. The starter was gone, solenoid busted. And that's what the man next door said. I hitchhiked up the road a ways, thought it'd take a couple of days the way these people pick you up, but I finally got a ride in a pickup truck. Took me down to Bettis' junkyard, got me a starter. Only $15, no charge for the grease. Well, I put that starter in myself, recharged the battery without any help. Started like a dream this time, chugged a ways on down the line, and slid right off the road. Clear ice. I started to curse, then I started to freeze. I finally got myself that wood, some more time passed for bad or good. Got that cabin fever bad, went next door, thought we could gab. Nice weather we're having, I says. Hey, yep, some people think so, he says. <sighs> Sat for a half hour staring at his feet and left. I got those February blues so mean Had to do something or I'd bust my spleen Went for a good cross-country ski Wound up wound around a tree He limbed it Damn near deballed me Froze my mucus Well, I thought I had the car 
car trouble, licks, got studded snow tires, nice and thick, new battery, new shocks, new points, new plugs, anti-freeze, anti-knock, anti-mam, anti-bug, when mud season came, got out to get unstuck and sunk to my waist. myself home, washed my hands, used the telephone, called the man with four-wheel drive, said, help, Mud's eating my car alive, come quick. He pulled, Mud sucked, my Dodge fell apart and left a little salt and rust. day of rain, you could finally see things starting to get some green, and the sun peeked out and ran away, and I said, ain't no use for me to stay. Amtrak, Greyhound, Delta Airlines, country roads, take me home. I came back to Vermont.